I'm Dr. Matt Probert. Uh, I'm the admissions tutor at the Department of Physics at the University of York. I want to do is talk to you a little bit about the admissions process, where you are at the moment. You've received your offer from the University of York. We hope you take that very seriously. Just want to give you some extra information to help you consider your options and make sure you're making the right informed decision. You may have heard in the press recently, we've got the latest uh, national student survey results, and we're very pleased to see that 95% of our students rate the course as satisfactory, uh, got good high levels of satisfaction. 97% agree that our teachers are good at teaching, explaining, uh, make the course interesting, and 100% agree the course is intellectually stimulating. So we think that's a very fantastic set of results. Obviously, we're working to make it better at all times, but uh, we're very pleased that our students who have graduated look back on their time at York with uh, happy memories and have enjoyed it, found the course useful. So obviously where you are now, you're thinking about what are your options uh, and what you can do. Some things you ought to bear in mind. Um, once you get to York, and we hope you do choose York, you will have some flexibility to move between the different courses. So we offer physics, theoretical physics and astrophysics degrees and you can move between these any time in the first year. We also offer joint honours degrees, maths and physics, physics with philosophy, and you can move from the joint honours to the single honours uh, if you wish to as well. We also offer all these degrees in both Bachelor's of Science and Master's of Science versions, the MPhys, the Integrated Four Year Course, and if you wish to, you can switch between them once you're here, as long as your marks with us are above a threshold, and there's no problem with student loan company, you're getting the extra year of funding, it's all sorted, uh, it goes forward very simply. The other question I'm often asked at, uh, when we do open days and we do visit days and things is, what would happen in the summer if I don't quite make the offer? Obviously, if you don't quite make the offer, then you've not made your side of the bargain. My part of the bargain is making you the offer, offering you a place if you meet those conditions. If you make York your first choice, but are a near miss, then if I had any spare spaces in results at August time, then I would much rather fill up the course with you than with other people uh, from other university applications or with other grades. So obviously if you don't make the offer, we can't promise you a place, but we always do our best if you're a near miss. The other thing that's worth saying is about accommodation. One of the nice features about the University of York is we do offer accommodation to all our first years. In the last two years, we've opened two new colleges of accommodation on the new campus. That's given us uh, over a thousand extra bedrooms, and so there's no problem offering accommodation to all first-year students in university-owned accommodation. Anyway, there's lots more we could talk about. Uh, don't want to go on for too long. I hope you enjoy the site. Have a look around. If you've got any questions, send us an email, get on the phone. We always want to hear from you. Thank you. Goodbye.